It's springtime, and that means it's time for terrible, awful allergies. <laughs> your doctor might recommend something if you're sneezy, like a neti pot, which involves pouring water up one side of your nose and letting it run back down the other side. Why does a neti pot make your nose feel so good, but water coming up your nose unexpectedly hurts so much? I investigate. Water, especially if it's sort of cold water, um, the, the actual sensation of the temperature can be very uncomfortable. The same way that you can get brain freeze, for instance, from drinking something that's very cold. The inside of your nose is covered in nerve endings. Those nerve endings help you feel pain like when water shoots up it. But what really makes the difference between the painful pool water and the neti pot water is how salty it is. The cells in our body sort of have a certain salinity content and so fresh water doesn't have any salt in it um, and so it's very shocking to the inside of our nose when, when water goes inside. So your body is waging this internal war between your salty nasal passages and the unsalted water and that back and forth can cause pain. And that's why your nose a lot of times if it is exposed to water will start running and you'll sort of have to blow your nose a lot. In addition, the lining of your nose, the cells inside of your nose are designed to secrete mucus. That's actually sort of their normal function. And they do that also in response to an insult. I really like the word insult as something that bothers your nose. I feel like my nose is probably insulted all the time. So if you want to keep your nose from getting offended, you should probably plug it before you do a cannonball.